What is going on guys? Welcome to a brand new video. Welcome back to the channel. It's Dev. We're here. Barry episode 5. This is an episode that I've heard is definitely one of the best. I have no idea what happens in it. All I know is what happened last week, which was what? Literally. What? Like, I forgot the cop's name. Loach at the end. You know, once buried to kill the guy who's with his ex-wife. That's why he wanted Barry all along. Not because of Janice. Because of him. W what was his name again? Ronnie or whatever. Yeah. And Fuchs and everything. And that, it was crazy. And then we saw some stuff with Sally. Sally and Sam, that shit was awkward, weird, but, you know, it was a really well-performed episode, acting-wise, well-written. This show is really good, and from what I've heard, this episode is very good, too, so I'm excited to definitely get involved with this episode. Um, so, yeah, let's get into Barry, ladies and gentlemen. Let's do it. In three, two, season two, episode five. In three, two, one. Oh, we're starting it like that. Okay, that's interesting. Sparking the joint. You know, I might join him. I might join him on that. On that offer. For you, man. I'm sure they got Taekwondo in Chicago. So you go, whoa, look at that, you got medals too. Shit. Wow. Ha! <laughs> These medals. Chicago from LA. That can be pretty long. Sometimes I do Google Maps and Waze at the same time. It's kind of a little fun game to see which one's which. Ah! Yeah, I was waiting for it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> He's got another one. Oh, we good? We good? No. Dude, his throat. He's grasping for her, man. I hate that noise. Oh my god. His breathing does not sound good at all, dude. Uh, listen, man. Uh, 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 son of a bitch, dude. Oh, my God. Oh. All of that for him just to die like that? Oh 
Oh no. I thought you were a dog. Walking out with your mask off, my guy. Why? Why? I'm cut really bad, Fuchs. I'm, I'm trying not to fine, walk out. Fine, fine, but he's he's dead, right? Very is Ronnie dead? Yes. Yeah, you never really checked, my guy. Oh. How's that? Just parking out in the open right there? At a store like this? That And I understand that. It's kind of why we're put on this earth. We're the strong, the disposable, the killing child, Jesus. Very I'm sorry you had to go through that. He didn't kill her. Well, <clears throat> if you weren't fucked up before, you are now. I didn't kill her. What? She attacked me and ran away. We gotta go kill her. What? Oh my god. Where she could be anywhere. We can't we'll find her. We go. I'm dying. I'm, I'm fucking I'm dying. dying. Something bad's gonna happen, dude. Oh my god, she's right there. I'm not killing a kid, Fuchs. Plus, I don't. I don't think she's of this world. <laughs> so you don't warn us. See right here, they, they look like they're not gonna. So don't, 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 don't run away, dude. I'm a nice guy. What? She's not human. That's what I said. <laughs> She's something else. I don't know what. What do you, you want to do then? All right. That's good. All right. Buddy. Buddy, wake up. Wake up. Hey. I know. I know, but you should be good to go up on the roof. She's still up there. Oh, my God. He's been here the whole... So slow. Oh. That's... <sighs> Looks good to me. Oh my oh. god. That looks really good. Yeah. Ah! Oh. Oh. Ah! Yeah. What is that? Yeah, it's super glue. Super glue. There you go. Ah! I'm filling up the hole. There it is. It's perfect. Oh my god. That's nice. Okay. Ah! I don't think so. Uh-uh. I'm gonna call Hank. We're gonna set the whole thing up. It's her! Wait. Oh my god. 
Ah! Oh, oh. Take her off your face. I can't. Why? Because I super glued my hands to the steering wheel. Oh my god. Doing that. Oh, 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 They're literally just feral. His family is just feral animals. Literally glued to the car. He did Ronnie. What the fuck was that? Ronnie. Right. Really? You're not. You're not at a hundred percent. Right? Just your your throat's broken. Your stone. <laughs> You can hear fucking fuchs outside. Ronnie, listen, man. God. What directed by Bill Hader? Oh my God. What the fuck was that episode? Holy shit. That was insane. That might be one of the best episodes of television I have ever seen. Honest to God. That was insane. Ah, what the fuck was that? What the fuck? I mean... I don't even know. You don't start off with like like a, a cold open kind of thing. It's like just Barry right there and you're already like, okay, something this episode's special. And you start off, you're following Ronnie. Goes inside, grabs a joint, you can tell this guy's a stoner. <laughs> and also and then well, Barry's in there. It seems like everything's going well for a quick moment. Taekwondo martial artist or ta Taekwondo god, it looks like. Literally maybe the strongest man of all time. They start fighting, everything's going normal, like it's just a fight. It's like, okay, this is going bad. But the way it was done, the choreography, the, the, the directing by Bill Hader while being in these scenes it, it's insane it's insane i don't even know what to think wow man 
what is his daughter and and him? They don't die. He literally got shot in the face. And he got back up. He died because, or he had technically died first because of his throat, his, his pipe, whatever. And then his daughter was an animal, was not a human. That, what the fuck is going on there? What the fuck, dude? What in the actual shit? That was one of the most hilarious, you know, yeah, batshit crazy episodes I've ever seen of a TV show. Like, that was... I don't even know what to explain. One of my favorite lines was, Ronnie, your throat is broken. You're stoned. <laughs> like, oh my god. Like, what else would they be on? Him and his daughter to act like that. They, had, they barely had any emotion besides anger and, like, fighting. Like, what the hell was that? What the hell was that? I mean, I, I wish I would have watched this show when it was airing. Because I guarantee places like Twitter would be insane. After this episode aired. Because I'm a Twitter guy. I like scrolling through Twitter. Seeing all the mindless brain dead bot takes everybody has. It's it's great. And you know. With this show it definitely would have been a good time to scroll through Twitter. And just see people's reactions. That was fucking impeccable. I mean. Loach is dead now. Like. This is what the show, I feel like, was building up to the whole time. Like, we had the, all this build-up and story through everything else with with Hank and the Chechens, Fuchs and Barry and their stuff, Fer Barry and the acting stuff. And then at the end of last episode, Loach was like, I need you to do this instead of what I, you thought was going to happen. And then... This episode commenced, and it was maybe one of the best episodes of television I have seen. I cannot deny that one bit. That was phenomenal. Out of, like, all the Game of Thrones... Like, I'll, I'll compare it to, like, HBO, I guess. So, we got Game of Thrones. That was probably one of... Like, there's insane Game of Thrones moments that are like this. This definitely ranks above a lot of them for Game of Thrones. Game of Thrones still has some of the... Has maybe the best in Reigns of Castamir. But this really tops off just everything. The pure chaos that this this episode just ensued. It was done in a very well done made. Was this show ever nominated for any Emmys? I'm not totally for sure. I have no idea. But if it was, this episode is probably the reason why. And just everything else. But everything else before this episode was great. But this episode was, as a whole... It's one of the best episodes of television. Good job to Bill Hader. Obviously directing it, writing it. Phenomenal. The the stunt work with the with Ronnie and his daughter, those two performer actors, great. They did a fantastic job. Like that was great. That was perfect. Damn damn perfect. The the scene at the there's a lot of things in this episode that made it seem just unique and on its own. Like, I was like, they're doing so many things that would just, is just screaming like, oh my god, they could, where are the cops at? Where is everybody else? Like, how are they not going to get in big trouble for the, just what's like, and it's just, the way it builds up to everything. The scene with, with the daughter, the girl running up the tree and jumping on the house. Oh my god, Fuchs fucking gluing his hands to the steering wheel why <laughs> why why would that need to be done um barry i don't know barry got his ass kicked and somehow he's still alive he shouldn't be i wonder what he's what's gonna happen next episode because barry wasn't getting in the car the police what how, well, how did Fuchs get out of that? I bet Fuchs when he hit the back of the car police car he was like I was trying to get away because those two guys 
that guy was attacking my friend inside and I wanted to go to the get the police. I don't know. Something. He must have done something. How the fuck does he get out of that? This episode was the definition of a fever dream. It just embodied that. And it was fantastic. This episode was great, dude. Oh. Oh, man. I'm excited for more, dude. I know there's some good episodes on season three that I've heard of. I, I mean, I don't know what happens, but I always hear people talking about a specific episode, and I'm like, okay. All right. I'm waiting for that one. I better be pleasantly surprised. And this one was one I've heard is pretty, pretty, pretty good, and it lived up to the hype. It did. I can't, I can't, can't deny it one bit. It most definitely lived up to the height. The hype. Sorry, what did I say? If you guys enjoyed my reaction, if you did, please like, favorite, subscribe, hit the notification bell for daily videos every single day. Follow me on Twitter, Twitch, TikTok, and Instagram, and all the social media is down in the description below. This was a great episode once again, and we'll catch you for another video.